Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich. We just got through level 10 of Plants vs. Zombies for the PS3. So now, we got a Puff Shroom. It shoots short range spores at the enemy and it costs zero sun. And the reason for that is this. Blabby Wobble. Rabby Wobble. Blabby no sun falling from the sky. Still get sun from sunflowers, though, although after this level, that won't be important. And puff shrooms. Plant as many of those as you can, and you'll be A-O good. You literally will. I mean, you literally are just going to want to plant uh, the, the heck out of these things. The heck out of them, I say. Uh, this stuff isn't bad. I mean, you can grab other things. I'm not... Uh, yeah, you know what? Um, let's do this. We're only gonna have newspaper zombies. And, uh... Now, what I like to do is try to get a puff shroom on, uh... On every row. Well, I try to go down from the top until I know where the first zombie's coming from. Then double them up. It's two puff shrooms to take out a regular zombie. Alright, not a problem, because we already have one down there. Even if we didn't, we'd be fine. So those two will take out a regular zombie. Three will take out anything this level's gonna throw at us. So then I go back to getting my rows in order, because you, you're gonna want to be able to get two out at a at pretty short notice. Now, we always can rely on potato mines and stuff if we have to. But we shouldn't have to, actually. We've got a pretty decent thing going on here. Now, the sunflowers release sun, I think, at half speed. Uh, I can't guarantee you that, but they seem to go slower to me. Well, we're not having any trouble getting them out, though. That's cool. Alright, two on each row. We are going to go for a third. We're going to put it out front. Now, there's nothing we can do about the gravestones. They will spawn zombies. Oh, we got a present. We unlock co-op and versus, which we won't be doing because I have no friends. But it's nice that it's there. Oh, I made myself sad. Damn it. I may have made a mistake putting that puff shroom too close. Nope, we're good. Alright, that's all of those that I want to get out. Now there's our standard set of... Oh, we got money! Cool, so now... Uh, things will start. Now these guys, their newspaper is their shield. When they lose it, they'll run at you fast. We're gonna freeze them, though. This is all I really want out of this level, is to get some... Some freezing stuff out for the newspaper zombies. We don't really, uh... We don't really have to. I like that the newspaper zombie is wearing a suit, though. I will say that much. Huh. I don't see any obvious threats to our, uh... Our yard at this point. Now, when the final wave comes, zombies will spawn from those tombstones. So don't fool yourself. They're there for a reason. And there's a reason to get rid of them. Now, as we progress through the night levels, we will get more and more tombstones that we have to deal with. That may not be true until we get the plant that helps us deal with those, but... Alright, we're once... I was gonna say, we're once unsure short of... So here comes our final wave. They should come right out of the graves. There they are. But we froze them and have plenty of puff shrooms. Oh, if he had eaten that one, I was ready to replace it. But um, We're in great shape. Yeah, we'll put a, an extra one down there. For the newspaper guy. Because he's such a diligent reader. A voracious reader. And a voracious eater of brains. Sunshroom. 
that's the answer to our sun at night problem. Uh, now, they grow bigger as they go. Okay, we've collected 270 in coins so far. When we collect 750, he'll sell us an extra seed shot slot. I'm just going to I'm gonna bust up the mystique of that. All right, there we go. Sun shrooms are going to be super important. All right, I think. Whoops. No, I actually wanted that. I think that'll be good for us. I honestly do. So now we have to go back and forth for these pretty quickly. I don't like doing it. And sun troops have a different dynamic because they don't produce 25 sun right away. They produce 15. So you can get three out really quickly and then you gotta wait. It stinks. Ah! Bottom row! Bottom row! That's fine. We'll make it work. Yeah, see how long we're waiting for our next sunshroom? Yeah, that was not as long as I thought. Once we get a whole bunch of them, we'll be fine. Alright. Good deal! Yeah, look at that. We just... I hate having to wait for things. I'm such an impatient home guardian. Like, I don't want to wait to find out if a zombie is going to successfully eat my brains. I want to know right off the bat. When the zombie starts coming across the lawn, I want somebody to be like, that one's going to eat your brains. And if they're not, I want to go, that one's not going to get a chance to eat your brains. But no, this game makes me wait. Alright. We don't have any... We just have regular zombies at this point. Garden variety. Just try to eat your brain zombies. We don't need any more sunshrooms. Now, the thing about sunshrooms is after a certain number of turns, they'll grow bigger. And then they will start producing 25, the 25 sun we want. Okay, you're getting frozen, buddy. That'll give me a chance to put my third uh, thing there. Yeah, I'll put a third one there anyway. Because we are going to have to deal with bucket heads in this level, and they're going to be a pain. A gigantic pain. I don't like it any more than you guys do, honestly. I know, you're just like, vertical sandwich! We don't want to have to deal with bucket heads! Well, you, I mean, me neither. Uh, I would rather all the zombies be weakling zombies that die with one hit, and I just get cool bonuses from them. That would be awesome. That game would get old fast, huh? So, what's going on? I, I, there's really not a lot I could do except wait for sun. And see what's coming out. And collect money, I suppose. So there's nothing challenging coming out at this moment. I guess we'll put another one of these out here. Again, just because zombies have to walk through that stuff to get to us. So. And then we'll just, once we have coverage, freezing coverage in every row, then we're just going to start backing up, taking out the, the puff shrooms. And uh, replacing them with repeaters. Because the repeater freeze combo still our, you know, that's still our money, our money bet, you know? Like, that's still the thing that's gonna kill us zombies. Not the stupid, not the stupid puff, puff shroom thing we get for free. Alright, so now we just gotta figure out where to put our first. And we'll know that the minute we see a bucket head. The minute I see a bucket head, I'll know where to concentrate my fire. Yeah, I don't I don't see one yet. Not at all. So I guess we're gonna concentrate it down here. We'll hear him. I'll probably hear him before I see him. I'll tell you the honest truth. They clank. <laughs> so ridiculous. I mean it's perfect. It's not ridiculous, it's awesome. This game is... Oh, no! Oh, really? Whatever, he's frozen. We have some time. There. That'll buy us even more time. That was probably unnecessary, but... We only need 25 more sun and we can take him out. There we go. 
Fantastic, right? All right, pick up money. Ooh, fifty dollars. All right, everybody. When we come back, uh, more of this. Thanks for watching, and uh, bye, everybody.